People of the Internet, welcome back. I still have headphones on. My name is Leech as always. And now it is also written on a sip pullover. Awesome. Red line means music video reaction. And today we will be reacting to something I have again, as always, or mostly as always, zero clues what it's about. The band itself is called Wolves at the Gate. And the song is called Drifter. It is the official music video, it has 72,000 views. And it is a Solid State Records band, that's all I know. It just dropped onto my YouTube a uh, couple of days ago, maybe weeks, and I was like, mm. <laughs> It sounds interesting, I guess. So let's react to Wolves at the Gate and uh, the song Drifter in a few seconds. The headphones on. Three, two, one, here we go. Pausing. The rotating light effect in the background, phenomenal. I love that. I would love to know how they did that and how to do that and where to get them. I like the shadow play. I like his voice. It's a rusty but good. Very has emotions. That's nice. I like this. So you good. Oh, those rotating lights are fucking phenomenal. It's a bit punky. I like that. It has this punk uh, thing in it. I really like that. Also like the music video, it just has a low budget feeling, but it still looks good. And um, also the guy in the background is interested because he's writing something on the glass wall. But that was a nice transition from real time to slow motion. It looks good. He's angry, he's really angry at something. Oh, it's plastic, it's not glass, okay. There was an old post-punk band that I really liked, but I forgot the name. They sound a bit like that. Maybe somebody if you know who I mean. They had two really great albums with the heart. There was a heart and a fist, I think. I like it when the singer or the, the whole band is just in shadow and we only see the when the light goes through his mouth and you see the translucency of it. It's very really awesome.
That was cool. I liked it. Respect to Wolves at the Gates and the song itself, Trifler. Cool, cool, cool. I need to check out more of uh, Wolves at the Gates. It's not exactly what I like, but it tickled me in different places. And uh, <laughs> if I check some of the boxes, then it's cool for me. And I'm going to check more out more of them, maybe even add them to Spotify or to my Spotify playlist. I really enjoyed that. Now, back to... The thing with the fists and the heart, what was that? What what was I talking about? I, I don't remember the band. Maybe some of you. Please, if you know what I mean, there was, there was an album cover. I think it was white and then there was a fist and a heart or something. And it had some, had some post-pop punk feelings to it or something like that. Then uh, please write it down in the comments so that I can find that again. Because I took, for the life of me can't remember which band it was, but it was awesome. Thank you very much for watching. My name was Leech. As always, write me something in the comments that I should react to next on the way down there. Click on the red subscribe button and uh, we'll see us in the next video. Until then, whoosh.